Hello and welcome to this new video. It is a part of a series, so if you are new, please take a look to the previous videos because they are all connected. You will find the link on the description below. Today we will see how to use functions with the Node MCU. We will use the RGB LED that we used in the last video. Even if you don't have the component, you can follow and apply in other components. Why we use functions? Imagine you have a set of blocks that you call several times. You are obliged to make a copy of these blocks. Moreover, if you want to make a change to one block of this set, you need to verify the whole code and errors might happen. We use functions to gather several blocks into just one block. Now I will create a function that will contain all these 8 blocks. I will call it red and it will blink one time the LED uh, in red. In the function category, you can note that I have a new created block called red. I will put it in the main loop to make the LED blink. Now I can upload the program and see. As you can see, I got the same result. Let's make more functions for the other colors. With this program, I'm looping between the three colors. If I want to make a blink with a modification of the delay, I need to create different functions with a different delay. But wait, there is a better solution. I can change our function and give it uh, the delay as a parameter. I just need to specify the name of the variable and the type. In our case, it could be an int or long. Once created, the parameter will appear in the variable section and I can call it by this way. Our function red needs now one more block which is the delay. It should be a number. This code will blink the in red our LED every one second. I will add more colors.
here I want uh, three times uh, blink in red and uh, five times in green with a different uh, delay. Let's try our program now. Now I will optimize the code by adding a char parameter. Every time I call the function, I need to specify the delay and the color. If the parameter is the character R, I will blink the LED in red. Beware because our variable is uh, type is char, so we need to use the simple quotation mark. Now I can call my function with the different uh, parameters. Here I made a mistake, in the name of the variable I should not put a space. Now I can test.
and here we are i hope that you liked the video and see you soon bye